Yeah, stay asleep so you can sleep on them. Yeah. Hey. Hey, little squirrel. Little squirrel girl. Pluto too. Okay, Marzi and Pluto. Oh boy. I'll get them all before, all of those anyway, before I go home. Say hi, everyone. Say hi. Oh, good. How long was your heat out, Pong? What was wrong with it anyway? She's real cute. <laughs> and she knows it too. Yeah, she knows it. She's got a nice spot right here. See that? Oh, yeah, well, Ed'll take care of you. I, didn't, I forgot to ask him. Okay, there's the, the daily picture of the butt, the heart butt. Little Marcy. Mm -hmm. Um, yeah, let, let's see. That's right. I saw Ed heading out to your house yesterday afternoon. Um, you'll have to ask Ed. I think one of them is, but I'm not sure. Oh, good. I'm glad. Oh, is it Pluto? Okay. I hadn't heard. No, not yet. Not. She's got her eyes open and she could protest here any minute. See, she's not. <clears throat> She's not in a coma, but I'm going to put her in one here. 
Oh, 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 she says, that's what you think, Ramsey. Here, how's your elbow? How's your elbow? Huh? Oh, no, we don't want to upset the mothers. No, no, no. She has a mind of her own. Okay, we'll have to. <laughs> yeah, I could tell she wasn't. She likes to hide for a while. Okay, MJ. Well, if I were you, I would decide. Um, you going pasta? Night, night. Hope to see you tomorrow. Homer, uh, the peas are good. Well, sort of good. Pippa had to go to the doctor today. And you know, I told Dr. Julie about the tragedy in the family, and I said, maybe she's picking up some sadness from me because um, she was sitting in Pascalina's rocker, and she never sits there. And she was crying and crying and crying, and she's had diarrhea. So, um, but Dr. Julie checked her all over. Yeah. Well, I don't know. Let's see now. Uh, yeah. Yeah, I think she's going to be good. Dr. Julie gave her some special fruit, uh, food in a can, ID it's called, and, um, and an antibiotic. But they checked her stool and everything, so... Yeah, she probably doesn't like me to be gone so much. Yeah, yeah. But it'll just be for a few more weeks. Mm -hmm. Yeah, well, you know, I'm not home with them all the time. I leave them quite a bit. But I am gone in the afternoon and no she can't come over even when she doesn't feel good she's naughty she jumps up and bites the leash and all of that stuff oh no no never No, no, no. I should let her because she would love to run around and play. Maybe we'll try it. It's too bad, isn't it, that they don't. When Maestro was born, she was here for two weeks, and yeah, well, she's got a nice big backyard of her own, and she runs with Murphy out and back, stays on her own side of the fence and all that. Yeah. No, Sunny hasn't. She's next. Mm -hmm. Uh oh. Hey, hi. Mm hmm. Hi, little baby. Huh? Mm 
very cute little girl. You're a very cute little girl. Hmm? <laughs> well, I noticed that um, she likes, she's not getting as relaxed as Venus did. Yeah. She said she wants to see into the camera and see who's there. She thinks her mom is watching. No. Pippa sure was interested in um, uh, Diamond and her, here, 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 and her talking the other night. Could you get a little relaxed? Hmm? Well, there's some personality for you. <laughs> Show some personality. The difference between Venus and Marzi. Yeah. I bet he loves that. That's good for him, for his muscles. Huh? Okay. Well, she doesn't like too much on her. Oh, wonderful. I bet he's smiling over that. Yeah, that we love to hear that poem. Yeah. Two, four, six, eight, nine. I wonder if she'll get any spots on her ears. Wouldn't it be cute if she'd get white spots? I've never seen any of the colored ear dogs get white spots. <laughs> oh, well, Pippa's got white, or um, Pippa or Kira. Uh, yeah, Kira has white ears with dark spots, but if she would get white spots, that would be cute. I've, I don't believe I've ever seen a dog with white spots on their ears. Say if... Um, Veen, um, justice would get white spots. Yeah. We could always hope for that. 
We'll say good night, folks. I'm just not going to go as fast to sleep as, as Venus was. Mm -mm. There's one of the little potatoes that, that goes really, really limp and nice. I think it's um, amber. Oh, are they? Okay, then this is her good spot right here. Is this your, what do you like? You like your ear done. Mm -hmm. They all have their own special one. Mm -hmm. Yeah, it looks like, looks like this is it. Oh yeah, there she goes. She said, not so fast, Gramsci. No, no, no. Not so fast. <laughs> How's this here? Mrs. Plants is going to be drifting off to dreamland soon. Oh, good, Lori. Because it was drizzly, right? Good. I like to think of you walking to work with that hat on. She's got little white hairs here. Oh, she said, don't do that now. Oh, my. Yeah, I've had my hat on, too. Oh, my. Yeah. So sure is cute. Okay, well, time for you to go back to mommy, and we'll get we'll get Sunny. Say night, night, folks. Night, night. My cute little self back to bed. Yeah. Oh, maybe she's going to like the arm massage. Look at Venus is still where I left her. Good. They need a good 45 minute massage. Okay, you be down, you be down there just like a good girl. Stay on your side.
Say hi. Hi, Lori. Hi, Homer. This is the Cowlick kid. There's a, a new technician at the vet that has a, a mohawk. And I almost told him about, about this girl's little mohawk. Oh, cute. I wonder if Savannah noticed that. <laughs> yeah, she does. She loves she loves her massages. And I asked, hi Tonka. <laughs> yeah, we'll put gel in it. A little peak. I combed Louise's hair up into a a mohawk when she was about a year old and her and for her pictures and her dad had an absolute fit and made them be retaken. He said, What is the matter with you, Anne, letting your mother do that? <laughs> Uh, you want her? You better speak up, Monique. She's a little hairy. Oh, yeah. You better tell Ed. She is. I wonder if she'll be bigger than Harry. Harry was always little, wasn't he? <laughs> <laughs> oh, she's all stretched out. Oh, oh darling. Mm -hmm. Does is Harry's nose is liver, right? Yeah, she's she's really Yeah, but she's going to have to turn on her side because she does enough of that in her her kennel her in her box. Say hi. But she's good about laying on her side. Mm -hmm. Perfect nubbin. Yeah. Perfect little nubby. Mm -hmm. And little little feet. She's got that one black spot here on her foot. Oop. Two over here. And what about this one? All pink. Oh, no, here's a little bit. The back ones are pretty pink. Pretty pinky. I'll weigh her. Okay, I'll weigh her before I put her back. She probably, I'll say she weighs uh, four pounds. Oh, two on ten ten. What's today? The thirteenth. Oh, well then she couldn't weigh four pounds. She could actually. Well, you know, Obo and Bobo, they gained, they gained four, no, no, yeah, four to eight ounces a day. So, that's normal. Right. Well, we'll find out. I love her eyelashes. They would be a cute pair, Monique. Look at her. Look at her eyelash. 
there so long you could curl them. Is um, is Her Harry Harry is uh, Kira Akira Pop, isn't she? Or he? Yeah, I always thought that Hank would be bigger. Aww. Oh, I know Harry's eyelashes are white. Mm -hmm. Yeah. We had the best movie last night. It was so good. Oh, Debbie Reynolds was the mother. And this was, it's called In and Out. It was about a teacher, a gay teacher who didn't want to, you know, he didn't want to admit, he didn't even know him himself that he was gay. And um, he went with a girl for three years yeah, Kevin Klein, that's right. Yep. Mm -hmm. Do you like that movie, Homer? Yeah. And um, I loved it. I just loved it. And then on their wedding day, she said, I do. And he said, I'm gay. I just loved it. And then her reaction was really something. Yep, in and out. Mm -hmm. It is, it's good. And it was filmed in nine or maybe it took place in 97 and it was filmed in 99 or something like that. <laughs> well, she's pretty relaxed, but we'll see. Not that relaxed yet. I guess they all love their shoulders. Hi, Sonny. Mm -hmm. Oh, baby. Hmm. Yeah, I've heard about that one, Lori. No, but I think that looks good, too. And they play a married couple, right? Oh. I remember when you were there in the summertime and your niece was, and you were playing um, some kind of that tether ball or something. She was so cute. What's that on you? A little piece of something. Okay, Lori. Do you have to go to work tomorrow? You sleep with the angels too, Lori. Good to see you. Oh. 
how good. I don't even want to talk too loud. Did um, did Venus turn over yet? Oh, good, Lori. Well, I'll post on Facebook. Maybe I will stay home tomorrow for a starship, but then I'll have to come here after. Because I can't stand not to see the pups. Oh, good. Well, then you'll, you'll see Pippa and Pascalina if I stay home. Oh, well, she stayed a long time on her back. Sonny, you should have your, your little bicycle exercise. Well, it's always nice to stay home on a Sunday. Do a what? Oh, a shorter starship. At home, like an hour. <clears throat> oh, that's a good idea. Yeah, and then I could spend a lot of time on um, on my um, watch my jigger smiles. Mm -hmm. Mileage, I should say. I don't know why I don't do that every day. It's beyond me. I'm going to go to Office Max and get a, a book so I can write it every single day. I'm just sick and tired of that. Yeah. That little agate is walking all around pretty good. Oh, those, those, those potatoes are getting big. Oh, I see he's got, um, must be um, steel. His leg taped up, huh? I just noticed it. Look at the little tongue. <laughs> yeah, you can't beat a white bulldog. Good, good girl. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. 
<laughs> no, it's Kira. Oh, now opal snow. Chihuahua fever? You want to get a Chihuahua? Yeah, she's, I like that too. She's like uh, Venus. She relaxes really well. She's got a little spot here on her ear, right there. little piglet ear. <laughs> hey, did you know that my sister adopted a, a white chihuahua? called, uh, I forget what they call her, but she's teeny little, teeny weeny weeny, little white one. And she sits on the back of the couch while my sister practices her guitar. She's very cute, her name is Candy. <laughs> really? You remember Harry too, don't you, when he's this age? I think I remember him in the pajamas. Did he have the pajamas? A teacup, I know. I want one too. Mm -hmm. How is Gary, Debbie? Mm -hmm. Yeah, you just lay down. You just be good. You just be good and say hi to everyone. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Oh, wouldn't that be darling? They're breeding them smaller and smaller now. Uh huh. Good. You be sure and say hi to them for us. Okay. That would be nice. I just heard about um, on the CBS Saturday morning today, the teacher that sold her lesson plans on, on the internet and she's a millionaire. Thanks, Homer. Yeah, that would be great. Yeah, I do, but you know what? I heard um, that they're starting to have problems with them. As usual, you know, there's problems with any any popular breed.
Really? Yeah, it just depends on the dog though, Homer. You notice that um, Marcy has, has a little different idea. Well, then I could, I could stay home and massage puppies. Who wouldn't want to do that? Hey, people could bring their puppies to me and I, for a little massage. And I could do it on the internet right at home. Mm -hmm. <laughs> yeah, and then they could learn from my massaging. Yeah, good idea. I wonder who would bring me their puppies. That would be so much fun. It would be hard to charge anyone for that. Oh, from the dog pound. But how many puppies do they get? No, it isn't so far-fetched. Uh, yeah, sorry, MJ, I, I didn't see that. Let's see. You think the end of November? Well, when were they born? September 21st, I think, right? So September, yeah, the end of November is perfect. Mm -hmm. Okay. Three I'm weeks tomorrow. Too. They're great. Okay. How are you, Dan? Good. good. Did you have a good day? Yeah, so far. Good. It's good to see you. What's the name of the movie? Right. Perfect uh, for Thanksgiving. Oh, good idea, Tonka. Will you guys give me a recommendation if they want one? Mm. Well, I wouldn't really, I just would go in there and massage them. I wouldn't take them home. Well, let's see. But wouldn't I have to have credentials? Or would my experience be enough? Oh, right, volunteers. That's right, they wouldn't have money to pay me. I'd go to foster homes. Is it Tom Cruise in that one? No, I'd probably, let's see. I want to have uh, an extra source of revenue so that I could you know, retire from my job and not have such a lot of heavy work, although I do love the job. But maybe I could do this for a long time. You want Pluto now? Okay. If I did this at home, I could I could give hour long massages for 
for one pump. Mm-hmm. Pluto, okay. Hopefully she'll she'll remain on her side after I put her down. Pluto, yeah, either one. I haven't had them. Two, four, six, eight, nine. Good. Good, Kira. <laughs> yeah, but that wouldn't be so good for the camera. It would make everyone seasick. <laughs> yeah, I, oh, that's a good idea. I could go around from house to house and have um, home delivered massages. How about that? Mm -hmm. I could pull up like like the uh, the the groomers do it at houses and and have uh, a massage. Well, that's true. I would charge enough so that the gas would be covered. I could uh, go out to Minnetonka and Edina. Yeah. 
and let's see, um, what's the place in near Roseville that's got some wealthy people? Uh huh. This guy looks like he's wound up. Are they? Homer, you notice everything. Yes. He's a little boy. He's a cute little boy. They're, they're what did you say, darker? No, they're darker. Look at how dark. Here, let's look at all of them. They're all dark. Oh, he's got one little pink toe. And, oh, more pink. But these front ones here, they're dark. And his, his toes are dark. But he's got, like, boots on. He was fussy. Oh, boy. Were you fussy? Huh? Well, you better, you better get get feeling better. Expel some gas or something. Some little puppy gas bubbles. Yeah. Okay. There you go. There you go. Are you getting your teeth? Oh, it feels like, oh, he is. He's getting his canines. Remember when we used to look at uh, the boys? The country garden boys? Oh my gosh. Look at those teeth. Mm -hmm. Look at them. Wow. Above the boots. Yeah, he's, he's pretty. He's really pretty. Oh, that could be Homer. Mm-hmm. Are you fussy with your teeth? Oh. Okay. Here. Here. No, no. No, no. He's an elbow guy, I guess. Are you an elbow guy? Hmm? Or a neck guy? Are you a neck guy? Teething ring, yeah. Hmm. And he's got one of those bones. I think Chicago sent me um, one of those freezer bones. I'll have to bring that. Put it in the freezer. Washcloth is a good idea, though. Mm hmm. Ed says he's getting up on his feet already. Hmm? Were you fussy? Hmm? Were you fussy? Hmm? Oh, he seems to like this. Hmm. No, I think uh, Venus is the lightest of the pups. Oh, doesn't he? Well, he was, 
Oh, the lightest in weight. Yes, he was. He was only nine ounces, nine and a half when he was born. Oh, shoot, I forgot to weigh Sonny. Hmm. You guys got to keep an eye on me. Right. Tomorrow I'll weigh him. Hi, Lily. Yeah, he does. He has a cute, cute profile. He's gonna have a little, a little nose, cute little nose like Maestro. Hey. Hey, maybe he is having a fussy day. feel good? You want to sit up? Okay, Mrs. Plants, you did really well. It's a quarter to ten over there, right? All right. Sleep with the angels. <laughs> See you tomorrow. Hi, hey, cutie. Night, Mrs. Plants. See two, four, six, eight, nine. How's your ear? Do you like to have your ear done? Mm -hmm. Hi, Irish. Irish Coco. Uh-oh, I found his spot. Um, we're having a nice little drizzle out here, Lily. Hi, Mary Ellen. Mm. Yeah. 
he reminds me a little bit of Buster. Quite a bit of like Buster. Oh yeah. I think I'd like it out there. Irish cocoa. Mm -hmm. That's good. We need rain. Oh, he decided to go to sleep now. Yeah, just, just stay asleep. Mm -hmm. Oh, I love rain. I absolutely love rain. Yeah, I bet your yard is happy, your grass. Yeah. I got all my winter things done yesterday. I would love it. They were just talking on the radio today about someone had moved to California from uh, Seattle area because Finally, the dull gray days got to them, so they moved to Los Angeles or somewhere. <laughs> yeah, go south or west. Huh? Yeah, and then they just moved. They were saying, they move then. Well, actually, some people get depressed from it, you know. I like it too. Who's crying? Who's crying? Kara says, well, then I might as well get up and leave. Boy, I better go get... I better go get justice for a while, little boy. Mm -hmm. Yeah, he's He's a roly-poly guy. Should we give you a little bit of bicycling? Mm -hmm. They're enjoying the TV in the other room.
that was so cute when um when Obo and Bobo got the raincoats. No, no, Obo and Hank. Yeah. Well, dogs make everything better, if you ask me. And pets of any kind. I think he's peeing his little pants. <laughs> yeah, he's cute. Okay, time for justice. Night, night, folks. Night, night. Cute little boy. Um, I, I'm not sure Mary Ellen I think a couple of these are and I don't know I, I think a lot of the younger the have to talk to Ed about that I'm just a masseuse Let's see. Two, four, six, eight, nine. Good, I can see them all. Oh, I see Ed has pillows. Oh, she's already relaxed. This is Justice, of course. She's the beauty queen. She's gonna, I think she's gonna look like Leonard for some reason. But maybe not because maybe she'll get opal color. But she's got a black face for sure that I don't think the black face is gonna change. Hi. Hi, baby. Hi. Mm, 
She is definitely a beauty, a beauty queen, aren't you? Mm -hmm. Yeah. Hi, Jerry. Did you have a nice day, Jerry? What did you do today? Mm. Yeah, justices. Didn't take long to get her really relaxed. Good. Skunk in the neighborhood. Do you live in the country, more or less, Lily? Of course, we get skunks all over around here, don't we, Paul? <laughs> all right. Well, good night if I'm gone when you come back, Homer. Sleep with the angels. Okay, she's ready for her. her bicycle exercise. Oh, you do? Okay. Amy and Wally stopped by to see the puppies on the way home from Wisconsin today, I guess. Uh -huh. A couple of them have been real relaxed tonight. She's not totally relaxed yet. Okay, Palm. Have a good night. Sleep with the angels. We'll be thinking of you. I think so, Mary Ellen. The little puppies, anyway. Mm -hmm. 
She's got some dark skin here and a little pink spot on her tongue. Oh, that's cute. Look what what Opal is doing, or what Kira is doing. She's holding her baby. Um, that is um, copper. did you ask me on? Oh, um, they have to be with the little ones for sure. So the bigger ones are, are here too. So yeah, I think someone's still with them. Yeah, because they could still be, they're pretty, still pretty vulnerable at, they were just a week old on Friday. Yeah. <laughs> Hi, Nicole. Nicole loves MB. Hmm. And what does MB stand for? Kim's Kim's dog, Mary Beth. This is justice. She's being a good girl. Let me see. 
Were they born on a Sunday? I guess so. Four weeks? Really? Oh, 923. Was, what day of the week was that, Jerry? I can't even remember anymore. There were, I know these guys were born on, the little ones were born on a Friday, right? Oh, they were born on a Sunday. Okay. Hmm. Wow, no wonder they're so big. Oh, I don't have a calendar right here. Does that make them four weeks? Hi, Burn. Yeah, I'm ready to leave in about five minutes. We went through all the puppies, the big ones anyway. Yeah, I don't think I got to um, give you a happy birthday. <laughs> I'll be back tomorrow. I haven't decided where I'm going to do the starship, but probably at home because people are missing the girls. And then I'll go to work and come over here if I can still make it. Yeah, evening-ish, after, after the, you know, working. Oh, Kim, is it three weeks? Okay. It seems more like it would be three weeks, but I don't know. Yeah, people want to see the girls, so. And, you know, Pippa hasn't been so well. She's had diarrhea for days. Yeah. So yeah, let's have the starship tomorrow. At my house. Yeah, they I had to rush her to the doctor today cuz she was sitting in Pascalina's rocker crying and crying and crying and crying. So I have to go home and see her tonight, too. Mm-hmm. Yeah, she's had diarrhea, Deb. And you know what Dr. Julie said? Because I, I said maybe she's responding to my sadness about the, the tragedy in the family. And Dr. Julie said that could very well be. Yeah, so sad. Because you know how they take on your, your feelings. It says that's not true at all. Yeah, they, they haven't had any any of that fancy stuff. And Pascalina's been eating the same thing, so. Yeah. Um, Ed's, uh, Ed's dad's wife, the grandson, um, Ryan John, and this is horrible for you to have to hear, but he he committed suicide last Monday. So everyone was, he was only 20 years old, yeah. And I've been just sick about that, but everyone went to the memorial today, a lot of people, Ed and Patty and, and uh, Wally and Amy. And I've been just sick about it. But I didn't go to the memorial, but 
Dr. Julie said maybe Pip was picking up on that. Mm -hmm. He was uh, in college. Yep. Maybe a little, but do you agree more with Ed? Because Dr. Julie put her on um, an antibiotic and some some of that eye ID food. And then Louise and Kendra had their birthday party today, a roller skating party. And I didn't want to leave her, so I took her over to the doctor. Right, okay. And it was a special thing for uh, stomach but they did check her stool and she has no parasites or anything. Uh huh. Oh, especially Pippa. She's just the most, the sweetest dog. Yeah. Uh, no, and his dad gave a nice um, message at the memorial to all the students that were there. You know, they were all heartbroken. You, when that happens, you think, gee, there, I should have noticed. I should have, I should have done something. And he said that, you know, no one knows, no one knows that anything could have been done. It's just uh, how it is sometimes. <laughs> Somebody tell TLC thanks. I appreciate her kind words. Yeah, and I don't know, because I didn't know the kid, really. Nice-looking boy, though. Really nice-looking boy, and I guess very, very intelligent. And, you know, sometimes it's this is a rough world for those that are so very smart. Yeah, my friend um, Cynthia committed suicide a couple years ago, too. And... Here she had signed up to be with us on Thanksgiving. She didn't say a word to anybody. <laughs> Thanks, I wish. Right. That's right. the the re how they found out my friend had had uh, committed suicide she didn't show up for work one day and her sister went over to look for her and found her I can't even believe that to this day hmm yeah. Okay. Oh, she looks so cute. She's got a cute little profile, too. Kira's having a little rest. 
And then Kira's having a little rest. And there they are. Two, four, six, eight, nine. Good. Okay, I'll see you tomorrow, guys. Sure. Come here, baby. Come here. Come on. Let's go outside. Come on. Oh, yeah. What a good girl. Come on. Hey. Come on. Hey, where are you going? Where are you going? Oh, she says, I'm not leaving my baby. Opal gets to stay with her babies. Look at that chin rest we got over here. That justice is beautiful, Opal. I'm not going to lie to you. Look at her. Can't even hold her head up, though. That's a problem. She's got to use Pluto's belly. Oh, she's beautiful. Just beautiful. You got some chin resters in here too, don't you? Come here, baby. Come here. Come here. Come on. You didn't step on your baby, did you?
start. No, I lost my keys. Thanks, though. 